Hello there, and welcome to episode 116 of this series, where I play the regions and provinces of Europe one by one on GeoGuessr, doing so in a tennis match format, meaning that every time I score a 5,000 point round, I get the tennis point, and whenever I fail to do so, the game gets the point instead. Also, there are time limits involved, 6 minutes for an individual round, 30 minutes maximum for an entire game of 5 rounds, and every time I exceed any of those time limits, I will forfeit the point of the round to the game. Uh, also, if I start the previous, uh, end the previous episode sorry, with uh, a 5,000 point round, I will knock two minutes off the game time available for the next episode, which I did, last, which I did not do last time. So I'll be starting with a full 30 minutes this time. And every time I score a 5,000 point round, whether it counts or not, in the, and during the, this game, I will cut two minutes, another two minutes off the uh, total game time per round I do so in. Currently, the score is that I'm leading the game 3-0 in uh, the first set of this match. I'm down 15 love in uh, the current game. And I think I um, have good chances of winning this particular point rather quickly because we are heading into San Marino. And we're heading into the Fiorentino uh, Castile of, uh, Castile of, uh, of San Marino. And as you can see, it's not, it's not a huge place, which none of these have been. And uh, it's got 42 locations. It's the, it's the first map I've been able to make in San, Mar San Marino where I could actually do a polygon map and not having to handpick the locations. So 42 locations, well, that does run the risk of getting repeat locations. So I just hope we avoid that. So this uh, area of San Marino covers uh, six and a half square kilometers. There's two and a half thousand people living here and uh, well without any further ado let's go. And start the game. 30 minutes on the clock and we won't need that. Casa, cas, casa, okay. Casa de Rispar Mio. Okay, this uh, superstore, Centro Comercial San Marino. Okay, so it must be down here in Fiorentino. No, 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 no that's the, that's a superstore coal. Uh, that can't be the same place, can it? Well, there can't be any other places. So SMR might have turned into. Smart might I can turn into call. Yeah, that does fit what I'm seeing there. Then there's a casa. So there's a bank here. It's kind of get the feeling that it might have changed ownership or something. Mm, and Bad Rugiada. That also seems to have a different name. Whoa, that's not the way I was going. Let's see. Tabarini. Crystal. Well, it seems like pretty much everything here has changed ownership at some point. Which is the current one, I don't know. But we should be here. Yes. So that brings us to 15 all. In no time flat. And 28 minutes on the clock. Let's go on. Ooh, up in the mountains. End of the road. Well, that's helpful for me helpful for me. I just need to figure out... <laughs> well, yeah, the, this particular road ends in the, at your house and also where the white stripe ends as well. Now, we could actually be a little unlucky. Well, it depends on your perspective, I guess, but uh, when I mean unlucky, it is that we might have to go for a little while until we figure the name of the road, for instance. There are some mountain roads, or this must be uh, this place must have lovely views on days that aren't as misty as this one. And this must be early in the morning, I think, or possibly. Let's see, where's the sun? Now it's in the south. About 11 o'clock. Right. So we're somewhere. And uh, 
somewhere has a road called Le, Le Bruziata. Okay. And we're coming into a road that will run southeast, northwest. Southeast, northwest. So we could be on down here. There's the Bruziata. And, uh, oh yeah. I think this is where we started out. Yeah. It was. So that is 30.15 and 26 minutes on the clock. I have a feeling we won't be needing those. Well, this is fairly urban. Especially when there's only two and a half thousand people living here. I have a feeling that my, quite a few of these houses might house people who aren't actual citizens. Via Monte Segizzo. Oh, I'm moving north. Could we be over here? Oh, we like Chiesa Nuova. No, no. We're not in Chiesa Nuova. Let's see. So. No, we're not in Moda. Oh. oh, yeah. There we are. Via Imperiata. No, in Pietrata. Let's see, let's put it down by the Brandano for now. That could be the one going off to the side here. That is the Brandano. So we are. That's the Via Fondo Poggiolo. So we're here. And that is 40.15, and I'm romping my way to 4 nil up, but uh, so let's see, 24 minutes left on the clock. And I've spent 4 minutes <laughs> playing this. Um, it's almost like I should do a bonus round of this thing. But now, just for the heck of it. Fosse della Ralpe? Is that what it says? Rupa. Uh, via Raffanella. Hmm. Yeah, this, this region is just too small, really, to. Provide any proper gameplay, really. Well, that said, I'm actually having trouble finding this thing. Huh. Okay. Did not expect that. No, there's the Raffanella. Oh, we like. Ooh, ooh. And there's the Fossa de la Rupa. So we have just actually crossed into San Marino proper. So there's a Ford, or a, let's see. Hmm. So here we go northeast. So we are on this bit of the road. Yes, I got this house that is almost in the middle of the road, which is this one. And what's, what's the uh, some utility building or something out down there? So it should be here. We'll talk about being on the border. Yep, and that is for little to me. And I thought I was going to... Well, I've had some fairly easy maps, though. So, let's see. And uh, coming up with the next one is Strada della Volta and Via Vascone. And take it off to the east. Vascone and Della Volta. Della Volta. Delta. 
What's it? Della Volta, yeah. So, where's the Vascona? There's the Vascona, and we are here. Well, with that. That was way too easy. That was way, way, way too easy. 50 in love. And we were starting the next episode with a two minute deficit. So 28 minutes on the clock there. But yes, yeah, 7 minutes 14 seconds. That by far the quickest play I've had. So yeah, let's just do this. I won't be scoring this one, but let's just do another round just for the heck of it. Just to get to for the feel of the place. So we got via la arena and guidi and those are off to the south so maybe here yep there we go Giuseppe guidi yep and now we're on the Corpelli. And this road goes also goes off to the south. Let's see, so where could the Corpelli be? That wasn't quite as straightforward, was it? Where's the Corbelli? We are here. There. Next one. Ah, we're back here. That was, uh, let's see, then where was that again? I was, so, no, it was up here. And we were there. And <laughs> fourth round, uh, Ghiotti. And the Ghiotti goes off to the northwest. It's not that one. Could be here? No. Corbelli was gonna. Larena. The northwest Giotti. No, okay. We actually have to move a little bit. What's the name of this road? Okay, so we are on the Fornaccia, Fornaccio, and Gualdra. I can't remember seeing any of those road names. That's the Gualdra. Okay, let's see. So, what's the... That's the Ghiotti. There we go. Final round. This looks sort of familiar, doesn't it? Yep. Now, which one was that again? That was the... That was the Bruciata. So we are. Let's see now. We should be here. And there we are. <laughs> Three minutes thirty eight. Okay. <laughs> it actually felt longer. Yeah, that's um, that's definitely borderline in terms of what I should have included in in the series. But hey, that is episode one hundred and sixteen with the bonus round done, and uh, we did that in what less than eleven minutes or something. So yeah, that is this episode done and San Marino. 
Fiorentino done. Please check in tomorrow for episode 117, and let's hope and pray that that is slightly, slightly more of a challenge. Until then, bye-bye.